This is our car. Nancy Sleeth. We have a water tank. And Matthew Sleeth. Turn their lives upside down. Every one of our grandparents basically used to live somewhat more like what I'm living. They hang their laundry outside. These are all cloth napkins. And inside, they use our dishwasher as a spice rack. But why do they do this? Because Matthew Sleeth believes uh, the world's dying. And saving lives is something Matthew used to be really good at. Well, there's a lot of sadness because I love practicing medicine. Dr. Sleeth Sorry. gave up being an emergency room physician, but he didn't stop well, trying to heal people. In some way, still feel that I'm concerned about people's health, the health of and people God that have never been born you. yet. The future is not terribly bright. Dr. Sleeth wrote a book and began speaking in churches across the nation. Unless we change the way we live now. His book, Serve God, Save the Planet, has been an inspiration to those who've read it, like Zadie Ryan. Reading about what he was doing inspired her to act by making reusable grocery bags. One person really can make a difference. Julia Burnett got her church to switch to a more environmentally friendly heating and cooling system. But she says the hard part is trying to get individuals to change. A lot of people feel a lot of guilt, and so they do nothing. Somebody's got to go first. Somebody has to change their lifestyle. The house is a little bit smaller. The closet a little emptier. The temperature a little colder. But life in the Sleeth household couldn't be better. That's one of the rewards. <laughs> Tomatoes, cucumbers, squash. After giving up a life of luxury, does Dr. Sleeth have any regrets? Only that I didn't change sooner. Uh, only that I didn't begin uh, what I'm doing a lot sooner in life.